Hi, I'm Mike Thomas, superintendent and proud 1987 graduate of Brockton High School. And I'm Robert Sullivan, mayor of the city of Brockton and a Brockton High graduate of 1988. Welcome to the virtual ceremony for the class of 2020. Welcome friends, family, and fellow educators. We're not celebrating today the way that any of us had expected or wanted, uh, or even the way that you truly deserve, but uh, we didn't want to miss an opportunity, Mike and I, to honor you uh, and all that each and every one of you have accomplished before you begin the next chapter of your lives. You are the generation that will lead us forward. You are the generation that will stop the next pandemic. You are the generation that is going to push for a more just and equitable society that elevates everyone. And we can't wait to watch you and cheer you on and be there with you. On behalf of the entire city of Brockton, Mike and I want to thank you uh, for joining us today on your special day, your special celebration. We truly look forward to meeting with you in person the end of July to celebrate. So sit back and enjoy this virtual graduation ceremony with your loved ones. And we look forward to celebrating you in person soon. Have a great night. For the first time, Marciano Stadium is silent. Our school buildings are empty and our hallways are dark. If these walls could talk, what stories would they tell? They'd talk about your victories, your success, in and out of the classroom. Perhaps they'd play back a recording of past holiday concerts and musicals. But we don't need these walls to talk because your impact is everywhere. It's in the artwork you've left behind for future students to enjoy. It's in the way you've defined our community and set an example for how we should treat each other. And it's in the way memories of your music, your voices, and your laughs still bring smiles to our faces. So while your time with us has been cut short, know that you've had just enough time to leave your legacy behind. Brockton's class of 2020, you did it. Now go change the world. Welcome to the Huntington School graduating class of 2020, friends, family, and loved ones. I am Principal Jay Lander. To begin our program today, I'd like to welcome a distinguished member of our community who will lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. The flag that flies high above Marciano Stadium and is displayed at all Brockton graduations is dedicated in memory of the late Robert Leon Boss, a graduate of the BHS class of 1963 and in memory of all of our alumni who have given their lives in service to our country. We hold this celebration today under very different circumstances than when we left school more than three months ago. Our community has been greatly impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic. Our entire country is a bearing witness to the impacts of racism and many have opened their eyes and raised their voices to demand social justice. 
On behalf of the Brockton Public Schools, I ask you to please join me in a moment of silence to remember the lives of Ahmad Aubrey, Brianna Taylor, George Floyd, and the loved ones and neighbors we've lost during the COVID-19 pandemic. Thank you. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic in which we stand, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. In closing, I call your attention to those final words with liberty and justice for all. Please consider what you can contribute to make that aspirational phrase a reality. It is now my honor to introduce Mr. Cunningham and the Brockton High School Senior Concert Choir who have prepared a special musical performance for the graduating class of 2020. Yeah. 
424,000 seconds, 140,000 hours, 2,340 days ago, you entered your ki kindergarten class ready to face the world. Today, as you graduate, the Huntington family and I fondly look at each one of you. I know that with all the challenges you've boldly faced throughout these 13 years of schooling, numbering for the most part many, many more of your than your same age peers, you are ready and able to make a difference in the world. Please take the lessons you've learned, whether academically, socially, or emotionally, over your time with the Brockton Public Schools and do something with them. You've made a difference in our lives, and now it's time to go out into the world and do the same there. To our graduates, Sky, you are one of the most popular kids we had. You're a giant of a man with as big, if not bigger, empathetic personality. Even though you didn't always follow your own advice that you shared with the younger students, you could always be counted on as a mediator when issues arose in school. I know how you are with your little brother and how much you care for your mother. I see you being a great family man in the future. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. Rodrigo, you're one of the most kind-hearted students we've had at the Huntington. Sure, you've made mistakes in the past, but you consistently have demonstrated that you are well on your way to adulthood when you took ownership of your mistakes and try to make better of yourself. Also, whether it was in class or playing sports, you always displayed intense effort and commitment. We will miss you, Rodrigo. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. Dylan, you've been with us since you started in elementary school with Miss Tully. In that time, not only have you grown into a good man, you've grown to be one of our nicest kids we've had go through our school. I want you to gain more confidence in yourself and know that you're gonna be great at whatever you do in life. We don't have many students who have been hired as school-wide instructional technology, but you did that. Now go out there and use your charm and winning laugh to conquer the world. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. Connor, you are one of the most interesting kids I've ever met, especially during the first eight months of perfect behavior you displayed when you came to us. Not only do you know everything Patriots, you're incredibly intelligent and knowledgeable about the world. You have always been a strong thinker and have never budged when you felt a certain way. There's a need for that in this world. Go out and tell people how you feel about things around you and back it up with things you've learned throughout the last 18 years. You have an awesome immediate family, so use them for support, but also please utilize the strong relationships you've developed at the Huntington to further yourself. Oh, and sorry for waking you up at 11.15 last Friday. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. Mariah, you're an incredibly gifted and beautiful young lady with a great sense of humor and a brain to match. I'll always remember you taunting me with pictures of cats as I walk through my office, making fun of my allergies and dislike for everything cat. With more confidence, you'll do great things. Learning comes easy to you and will lead you to the path of excellence. Keep your cats to yourself as I congratulate you on your achievement. You earned it. Michaela, or my Kayla, as I like to call you, I've missed you tremendously since earning your credits in order to complete your high school requirements early. You have an infectious personality and everyone loved being around you. You were so great with younger kids and always willing to advocate for those who couldn't advocate for themselves. This is an incredible and noble skill to possess and should prove to further you in your endeavors. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. Monroe, Rosie, you always told me you're my favorite student. I'm going to plead the fifth, but let you know I've always admired your strong will and fortitude. When you believe in something, you have the ability to prove your point as well as anyone I know. You consistently impressed me with your ability to balance school, a job, a car, and a significant other. I'm going to miss you chasing me around the hallways, screaming, Miss Delander, I have a question for you. That's not true. I won't miss that, but it, what is true is that I'm going to miss you. Congratulations on your achievement. You earned it. To all of you, I say, 
your ability to focus and achieve given the numerous demands and distractions all around you have always amazed and impressed me. This ability has led you to who you are today, a 2020 graduate of the Brockton Public Schools. The Huntington family, of which you will always be part, wishes you the best on your journey through life. Your teachers wish they could be with you today to congratulate you as you begin this exciting next chapter in your lives. They've recorded a special message to let you know they're thinking of you and nothing could stop them from celebrating you. Congratulations, graduates. This is my senior photo, Brockton High, class of 1986. I wish you all the best of everything. I'm very proud of you. Keep up the good work. Hello, 2020 graduates. I wanna congratulate you on completing this step of your journey. I know there have been many challenges along the way, but I'm proud to say that I've watched you learn and grow and develop the skills you'll need to thrive in the world beyond high school. It's time to begin the next step, whether that's work or education. Believe in your ability to follow that path. There are many people who are there to support you. So take a deep breath, pack up your toolkit, bring your sense of humor, and continue your journey. I wish you the best. Remember, you've got this. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I'm State Representative Claire Cronin and I am proud to be here with you today. You are wonderful, amazing students. I'm looking forward to seeing all of your accomplishments in the years ahead. But for today, enjoy your success, enjoy your family, enjoy your friends, and we look forward to seeing the many great things that you will be accomplishing in the many years to come. Good luck. It is now time you've all been waiting for the recognition of all of our 2020 graduates. Hi, I'm Terry Finnegan, Assistant Principal at the Huntington Therapeutic Day School. It's my pleasure to be able to recognize our 2020 graduates. Skylar Bryant, Connor Burgum, Michaela Collins Lewis, Rodrigo Fontes de Costa, Araya Mendez, Monroe Orland, Dylan Wong. I wish each of you a future filled with good health and happiness. Congratulations. Class of 2020, please rise and turn your tassels from right to left. Congratulations, you did it. This concludes our graduation exercises. On behalf of the entire Huntington community, I wanna say how proud we are of you. We wish you all the very best.